Hi, Linda Bowney here from StampingWithLinda.com, your cardiologist since 1997, helping you create cards from the heart. Today is a Create a Fold card, and what I'm going to be doing is this a uh, flap card. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. I am using the Dapper Denim. I have a piece that measures four and a quarter by eight and a quarter. I'm going to bring in my personal trimmer and I am going to score it at the five and a half inch mark. Now all of these measurements will be over on my blog, stampingwithlinda.com and if you click on the eye at the top if you're viewing um, on your phone or if you're watching in YouTube down at the bottom and there's a link that will take you directly to that blog post so that you can see how I created um, this card with all of the measurements. I'm going to bring in my Big Shot. I have my platform and I am going to bring in a piece of Dapper Denim and I'm using that layering scallop. I also have a piece of Vanilla and I have the stitched oval. I'm going to go ahead and run those two through the Big Shot. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back in with that vanilla um, layered. So I've got the, the scallop and I've got that stitched oval. Oh, does it want to pop out here? There it goes. And what I'm going to bring in is the little butterflies. This is from um, the Timeless Tags. This is an item that is retiring, and I hope by the time you get to watch this video, it's still available. But I'm putting those little layers down, or those little butterflies on my stitch layer. Um, oval and I'm going to run that through and I'm going to run it back through just because it's a little bit finer detail. Going to bring in my paper piercer. Now if you watched the video earlier I showed you how I was storing these um, butterflies and so when you punch out the little butterflies from this Die. It's just nice to have something to catch them because you will, can use them in another project. So I have gotten my um, oval. I'm going to then bring in my words. These words come from the beautiful U set, again using dapper denim. And I'm going to stamp the verse like so. Going to then do some layering and bring in that scallop. And I'm just going to use regular adhesive to put that on like so. I have a piece of Whisper White. This measures four and a quarter, excuse me, four by five and a quarter. I'm going to put that on the inside of that card. I have already taken my embossing folder. This is the uh, flutter by or fluttering folder. This too is a retiring item and I hope that it's still available. I am actually instead of using the embossed part that's embossed out, I'm going to use the embossed in section of the card. So it kind of gives a different um, look when it's debossed. I'm going to take that. I'm going to use some, some dimensionals and I'm going to just put the dimensionals on the top of that oval because I don't want too many because it's going on that flap. Got that. So I'm just going to lay that right about there. I'm going to go in and pick up some butterflies. These are from um, other projects that I have done. I'm going to bring in my Tombow um, glue and I'm just going to add some glue to those butterflies and I'm going to put them down here at the bottom. I also am going to be using the in color enamel dots. 
These are an item that will be retiring um, if they have not already retired by the time you get this video. And I'm just going to put those butterflies down like so. And then I'm just going to go in and grab a couple of those enamel dots and just put them right on the center of those butterflies. And yes, my dog wants to go outside, never fails. I get on the video and she thinks that she needs attention. I'm also going to take that heart from the enamel dots and I'm going to just put that heart right here. So there you have it, a fun flap card using several of the products that are be going um, out in this catalog. So make sure you check out my blog, remember I at the top or link at the bottom if you're watching on YouTube for um, the product code numbers. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.